Ask him about Brock Lesnar. Ask him about Brock Lesnar. Brock Lesnar has a cock on his chest. That's all everybody <laughs> wants me to say. Have you seen it? Yeah. He's a fucking cock fucking with balls and it's pointing right at his fucking neck. What do you think of the, the fight? What do I think of what fight? Brock Lesnar's Frank, fight? Frank Brock Lesnar. I think Brock Lesnar's probably going to win. God damn it. Whatever. Fucking wrestlers. I'm over them. Uh, <laughs> he's a big dude. So what? You know what? Of course. It, it, I just feel like it, 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 losing to a man with a cock on, your, on his chest it's just by, like, so bad. It's even worse than wrestling if you got pinned and that was just right on top of you. No, but I'm saying, like, because he's, he's the guy, he's the ground and pound guy. He's going to be over the top, like, look at the cock. Look at the cock. You know what I mean? Tap out with cock guy. Tap out with cock guy. You, you know, it's going to be the, you know, I mean, demoralizing <laughs> in so many ways. And he looks like the humongous, the, the gayest, humongous dude ever. His face is just says, cock in my mouth. And he sounds like a really nice guy and he's a gnarly athlete, but he is the gay, he is the gayest head I've ever seen on an individual and then you just go down and there's a penis on his chest. <laughs> it's fucking terrifying. This are, man is easily the most terrifying person I've ever seen in my life. Are there any gay MMA fighters? Yeah. That's I don't know them. Right. But they've probably rolled with them and they've had their genitals around my ass. Who is this? Hello? Hello? Who is this? This is Koscheck and I heard you say GFP just right now, you queer. I'm gonna come over here. <laughs> <laughs> fucking sucks. I love GSP. <laughs> <laughs> he's a he's a he's a great wrestler. I don't like the fact that you you be giving him props on on there. Saying, Can't. I yes, just want to say shout out to uh, GSP and all the Canadians out there. They're great guys, and I look forward to uh, many many years of carrying the belt at uh, 170 from GSP. Oh my God! Josh Koscheck on the phone. Yeah, that is so. Stealing, attempting to steal the belt from Canada. Like man. You couldn't be in a better position to be hated by half a country. Yeah. Oh, well, it's only, I, you know, nah, I don't think the whole, can the whole country hates me. I said me. half. Uh, well, half of them I don't think hate me. Maybe a quarter. Yeah. Half of the MMA of world. Okay, yeah, maybe all of, all of that, but that's all, that's all besides the point. All right. Hello, hello. How's it going, mate? Uh, just walked out of the gym, got in my car, and was on XM, and you know what? I put it on your station, and I heard you say the name Canada, and then that other name, and I decided <laughs> to call in. Kiwi We're always cannot, talking Kiwi about cannot GSP. Be named. Yeah. We always talk about GSP on the show. You gotta, you gotta uh, listen more. We love that guy. <laughs> well, then I, that's why I don't listen. Right. Ooh! <laughs> are, you, are you still are you cutting weight? Are you getting butt hurt right now? Come on, dude. You're, you're tougher than that. No, I ain't getting butt hurt. You know what's crazy is Koscheck's black. Yeah. I'm half. And we were talking about that all the time. Did you hear I about know. the uh, old lady has a radio show? She said she said an, she said an, an, it's the N bomb with the R on the end of it. Oh my goodness. Yeah, but we're not allowed to say that word on here, right? Well, you can. No. What other word? Can well, you I say it. I got lectures. But I only say it if it's in the right con I can only say half context. Of the word I'm only half. Context. Context. Yeah, but you can still do it, because you look black. You're black. Oh, okay. Well, you know, I just got back from the beach, you know, a couple weeks ago, so I am pretty black right now. Right on. What? Well, brown. Bacon. We'll just, we'll just call it bacon. So you've had some vacation time, and, you're, and then what? What's your game plan? How? What's your uh, game plan to take the belt from Canada? Are you going to... Oh, I've, I've been training, man. Yeah? That's my game plan. Yeah. I just walked out of the gym right now. It was a great day, you know? Had everybody in there. Swick, Fitch, came the last guest, you know, uh... Thompson, uh, Trevor Pangley, I mean, the list goes on and on. That's a serious team to be training with. Yeah, you know, there was a lot of guys in there today. It was good. Do you spot Cain Velasquez? I have boxed with him. You know, what's funny is this, this kid is such a fast learner. Yeah. When he first came to AKA, like, about two years ago, I would kick his ass, you know, yeah. because he didn't know very much. Man, I beat his ass down. Now, I'm afraid of that dude. Cain Velasquez is that much better now. Yeah, he's he's um, he's he's got cardio for days. His boxing is good, and his uh, he's got nasty leg kicks. Right, he does have nasty leg kicks. See, yeah. that's what you need. <laughs> you need to put the fear in him. One of those, and then you've got a whole new game plan that the other guy has to deal with after just one good one. Yeah. It's gotta be. How's your leg kicks? Are they good? Uh, they're all right. You know, it's okay. What is it about a man that can learn how to like? How's like? You both train at the same place. How come Cain Velasquez can kick real good in the leg and you can't? Uh, I prefer to punch. Right, but it, so, but you, could you, because I feel like every MMA dude, just the one good outside leg kick, if you have a really good one, like, uh, what's his name? The Tiago, uh, fucking, 
I mean, that dude... That, you mean, that, that's, uh, that's like half his game plan. If he doesn't land that, he's kind of fucked. Yeah. So you got to have everything now, you know? Well, then so, you need to work on your leg talk kicks. Let's about MMA. Let's talk about something else. Yeah, get leg kicks, whatever, you know? No, he's talking. So, he's what up, what <laughs> I ride moto. I ride moto all the time. Can you ride moto? Do you want to go to Ellis Mania? I would love to. Do, well, it's November 6th. Can you make it? It's at the Palladium November 6th. And will you fight people? Uh, I will jump. What? I'll jump. You'll jump. Jump. Where are you jumping? Moto. No, Ellis Mania is a boxing, uh, it's a crazy boxing festival. It's where Benji won his fight. Oh. Uh, <laughs> yeah, you want to go in it? Sure. Well, you got to call uh, Mr. White and ask him, but I would love to. He's cool. My fight, too. He's cool, because, uh, yeah. what's his name? Shay Cowan, he's cool. We're cool. Is, uh, is um, Benji going to fight again? No, no, this time I'm fighting. Oh, you are? Yeah. Who are you fighting? I'm fighting a band. We Outspoken. Oh, nice. Yeah. Four people. Twelve? <laughs> Four. Four? Yeah. Oh, one after another, or...? All at the same another? time, motherfucker. Don't you know who I am? Uh... Could you tell me your name, please? <laughs> <laughs> Wait a minute. I believe they I'm the you. fucking cowboy! That's what they call me. The president calls me that shit. Obama calls you the cowboy? The president of Sirius! The real president! Oh. <laughs> you know Obama? Yes! Wow. <laughs> and he thinks you're a cowboy. Right. Yeah. And he thinks you're a cowboy? He <laughs> sticks up for me and calls me the cowboy. <laughs> Do you, does he put like a saddle on you and ride you? No, you, you don't do that to cowboys. Line. I know, he doesn't, no. You, you Metaphorically speaking, he is riding the cowboy! <laughs> <laughs> to glory! Yes. So, how, what are you guys, how long you guys on today for? Three hours. Do you know who Tony Hawk is? Yeah, he's a badass skater. He's gonna be on my show any minute now, and there's this other person who's black who's gonna be on my show in a minute. Oh, wow. Yeah, she's on. related to... what's that dude? Uh, Morpheus? Yeah, she's related <laughs> to Morpheus. Who's that? Lawrence Fishburne. He's the one who knows that the Matrix is real. I'm backing that dude. <laughs> wow. Yeah. Tony Hawk is gonna be on today. Yeah, Lawrence Fishburne's daughter. Yeah, wow. Yeah. I know, more hey. importantly, Tony Hawk, I know. Yeah, that's badass. Uh, it Tony is. Hawk's the man. He is the man. Yeah. You're gonna, you're attempting to be the man, but we don't want to talk about that. Tell, tell him I said hi, you know. Maybe I will, maybe I won't. He won't know who you are. I know that's cool, but you, you gotta get I, that. You gotta get that belt. Hold it for a while. Yeah, I bet you he knows who GSP is. I'm sure he does. Yeah. But, He's uh, a household name. Who? <laughs> George <Tony> Saint Pierre. <laughs> 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 George Rush Saint Pierre. <laughs> what is Rush anyway? What is that name? Uh, maybe it's his know. favorite band. Isn't it that stuff? <laughs> I hate that band. Who? <laughs> Russ just played in Vegas this past weekend. Sweet. Wonder if George is there. Yeah. He probably was backstage. Probably. <laughs> probably. You know Benji Madden? I do know him. Yeah, I know of him. Yeah. That's about it. That's about as far as it goes. Who else do you know that's cool? Uh, I know this guy by the name of uh, Cowboy. He's pretty cool. The Cowboy is pretty sweet. <laughs> Um, let's see. I know, uh, this one guy by name, uh, of, of Joe. He's cool. Alright. Well, we love Joe. Yeah, Joe's very yeah. cool. Everybody loves Joe. You know Dana Watch? Uh, yeah, I do. He doesn't like it. Ah, uh, that's okay. He loves me. Yeah, well, it's a love-hate relationship, then. Well, I have that a lot. <laughs> yeah, I can do that. You gotta see that next to me It's gotta be the